right-handed and you'll notice that I'm holding the ring at about the one o'clock, two o'clock, three o'clock position. And when I scoop a ring, I'm gonna touch the ring to the surface, to the bead mat, and pull up through the center of a ring. So I go down, pull up through the center of a ring. And I can do this for as many rings as, as I wanna fit on. And as you can see, they're not gonna fall off. What some people are tempted to do is to point the ring down and go through the center of a ring. And sometimes what happens is, as you're angling your ring down to go through the next ring, the first one falls off. So it can be done if you're really careful to make sure you're pushing the first rings away, but it, I see students drop more rings this way uh, than they manage to hang on to. So once again, I recommend coming up from the bottom. If you need to go through multiple rings, just push that first ring aside to go through the second one and then push both of those aside, let the bead mat hold them down, and then you can come through as many rings as you need to.